Hi guys, happy Back to the Future Day. Um, here it is, Perfect Pepsi. Uh, it's not, it's the one that Pepsi released. This is the New York Comic Con version. Well, I guess this, this is the same version they're gonna be releasing today, which is October 21st, 2015. Um, I required this through eBay, of course. Um, it was kind of a spur of the moment kind of thing. I found the cheapest one I can get. I'm not gonna say how much I paid for it, but it was not no six or eight hundred dollar uh, pop. Uh, as of right now, um, again, like I said, I've been making these videos constantly, uh, so it's still it's still kind of late. It's um, 1:44 a.m. So it's October in my time right now. It's Mountain Time, so it's I live here in Colorado, so it's um, October 21st, 2015 at 1:44 a.m. Um, so I've been doing my videos since my videos, all my videos since 12 o'clock. So about almost a good two hours now. Um, but yeah, uh, this is the Pepsi. Uh, right behind it is the thing I was going to show you in the last video, but I didn't because I, was, I, I totally spaced it out. But um, yeah, this per Pepsi, uh, perfect Pepsi from Back to the Future. Um, there is I've seen on eBay there was an actual authentic one from the movie. In the movie, it had the silver the silver ring around the top part right here and it even had a little uh flip straw thing so you can open it and in the movie it costs fifty dollars to buy a uh, perfect pepsi and that's kind of outrageous for a pop i don't think no one would be able to buy a pop unless it was like a fancy restaurant and that's the only way that you know whatever uh i'm overthinking it uh but uh it's just weird I didn't notice that until now, but you know, with them selling it today for twenty dollars and fifteen cents, which is kind of funny. Um, I wish they would have went out, just like with the you know, I with people with when I get my hardware, people were saying, even back then, back in twenty twelve, they're like, well, if you're gonna make something, make it right, and that's true, make something right. But I've seen in met okay, like I said in the last video, there's a thing in Mexico they're gonna have it to where they're gonna have it in theaters, and they actually have one that actually has the actual straw, so it op it actually pops open. And I wonder how that worked. I wonder if it means that the thing's already, you know, the seal's broken. Unless they have, like, a special plastic wrap around it. So that way no one drinks it or put anything in it. I don't know. Uh, if that does happen, I will definitely be getting it. Uh, just to have it. Just so I can, and then I'll do a video comparing each one. Um, and if you've seen my pitch, my videos from, the, from uh, well, probably been a few months now. Since I did it, was that Bring Back Crystal Pepsi thing. Um... I'm still looking for bringing back Crystal Pepsi. I was even thinking about doing a drinking con a drinking Crystal Pepsi today, just for the hell of it, just because it's the 21st of um, October 21st, 2015. But I don't know. I'll still think about it. We'll see how I am, how I feel tomorrow. Um, but yeah, uh, it's just regular Pepsi. And the movie, from what I from what I remember and what they were saying is that it was supposed to be about vitamins and about nutrients and yeah you, that's how you get your sorts of nutrients and that that's why it was, it was cost from what i hear is it cost so much because of that but i don't know if that's true or not but yeah it's just regular pepsi and then of course here you see now because we've had the whole calorie thing so that has to have the calorie thing back right there and then the ingredients just regular um and i haven't opened it yet it even has tape i don't know if when they went to the whole um comic con if that was there or not so, but yeah, here's this. This is pretty cool. I, I accidentally bought this thinking that they're like the bigger versions of, um, of the, the replicas, but I, I was wrong. But that's okay. When I get the, the hoverboard, or what, I mean the, the Hot Toys, uh, Martin McFly, not the, the one they have now, but the, the uh other version the 2015 version yeah that's pretty cool though it's actually got the whole details in it i'll try to zoom up as much as i can so just like in the movie except it didn't come with the extra uh the other version with mcfly which is kind of disappointing so there's the back side and there's even actually like a weather thing for it. That's pretty cool. 
Um, but yeah, it's just little knickknacks of, of things from Back to the Future. See, you got Marty McFly, you got the fight art admission for the museum, the picture. Uh, the letter he writes to, to Doc, and then the envelope he puts it in. Um, just all kinds of crazy stuff. Um, I'm not going to really look into it too much because it was, it was kind of disappointing when I got it. I was, there's nothing, it's just, it's, it's just, there's nothing else in it. See, it's just all regular paper, unlike the almanac, the sports almanac. Um, hopefully I'm pronouncing it right. I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right, but, um, I really want an actual, like, papered, uh, actual, uh, like an actual, uh, paper, newspaper to hold with me, with my costume, but that's okay. Maybe some other day, or some, next year I'll do it again. I'll do a cosplay or something. So... Yeah, guys, hopefully that was kind of a fun thing because it's perfect Pepsi, you know. Um, again, it's pretty awesome. So, I don't even like Pepsi or Coke. I liked Coke back in the day when I used to drink it a lot when I was younger, like, you know, cherry Coke and all that. But, anywho, guys, hopefully you liked this video. Um, happy Back to Future Day again. Uh, again, like, subscribe, comment, dislike, um, ask me questions, whatever. Um, so be on the lookout for my, uh, other two videos that should be coming out today on my hoverboard. And, um, if Nike decides to actually surprise us and say, Hey, we actually have the Nike mags at the Nike store. So if you're lucky enough to get one right away, you can get it. That'd be cool. If or not, if online orders happen and I'm able to order it with one day shipping and get it tomorrow. So get it Thursday. I'll be happy because I'll get my jacket tomorrow. So, and my a uh, special noise thing to make my sound effects for my jacket. So, um, then I'll be a happy hands. Right? It, it, then it, this day won't be such a wasteful day. So let's just hope. I have my fingers crossed and hoping I could buy a replica, but that's going to take another week or so. And I don't have time for that. So, all right, guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully you like this and stuff and hope you like these videos. I posted these for back to the future. Hopefully you guys post something too, or, if you are something cool, uh, or Back to the Future or memory uh, that you had uh, growing up watching Back to the Future, obviously for me it was the like anyone else was the power lace shoes and the hoverboard and the self drying jacket, um, all of that is freaking awesome. And did you notice? Um, I don't know if I, I didn't. I don't know if I mentioned this, but if you watch the watch the part two carefully with the little girl with the hoverboard, if you look at her head, just look at it carefully and. Um, just really think about it out of the box what that might be and what that would be today in today's society what she would use it for so just i'm just putting it out there i'm not gonna tell you what it is i already know i i found out because i had like i said i've been on this um facebook page with back to the future forever um and i've learned a lot of stuff about back to the future more than i thought i would so i also got me a few games today um, well, obviously I got the Guitar Hero game, um, but I also got, uh, Assassin's Creed 4 Black Flag. I, I'm trying to get back into Assassin's Creed, and that was the one game that turned me away from it. I have, Un uh, Unity. I got that a few months back. I haven't opened it yet. And I even got me that Dragon Ball Z game that just came out for the 3DS. And being that the PS4, or an Xbox One version, of uh, Dragon Ball Z Xenoverse that got me back into Dragon Ball Z, I had to get this. So it's gonna be hopefully it's pretty fun. So as for Halo, that's another thing I want to do a little do a little update. Halo, I don't know if I'm gonna get it or not. I want to, but it's rated team for team, and that's kind of like pushing me away from it. But it looks so badass. Sorry again for the language. Um, but if I get it, I'm probably get the collector edition. I still have time to get it, so I don't know. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Uh, but Pixels comes out next week, next Tuesday. I can't wait to get Pixels. I like Adam Sandler. He's my that's my main person. That I watch movies, even if it's horrible, I still watch it. So I'm gonna be looking forward to that. And it's about video games too. So I'll be posing on my amiibos and take a picture and put it on my Facebook and stuff and Twitter. So that'll be fun. 
I don't use Instagram. I have it, but I don't use it. So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. I gotta stop blabbering on. Have a wonderful day. Bye.